Hello team Holy Fit. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited for this challenge. It's so dear to my heart because I personally travel all the time and it's been really, really easy for me to use it as an excuse uh, to not stay on track. Um, I'm super excited to throw that excuse out the window. A few months ago when I joined Holy Fit as a coach, I, I set a goal for myself and it was to make sure that I would work on continuing to eat healthy while traveling so that I could maintain the balance I've worked so hard to achieve and, and really just feel good about myself. And um, that ultimately will allow me to enjoy my, my travel a little bit more. So I thought that we could kick off Holy Fit Vacation um, with some tr tips on how to mentally prepare for a trip. So I did um, quite a bit of research on this over the course of a few weeks. and. There was one thing I found that just really stuck out to me because it was so simple. So I'm really excited to share um, this simple little little trick with you. So we know that when we, you know, before we go on any type of trip, whether it's a road trip or a weekend trip or, you know, a massive two month long vacation through Europe, we, we plan what we do. We plan what to pack. We plan where to go. We might plan our budget. So it really shouldn't be any surprise that that planning mentally for nutrition can go a long way as well. It 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 you know, it's something that's so simple that makes a huge difference. So the first thing that you can do is you can think about foods that are a big no-no for you. So what foods are you willing to slide on? Um so for me a big no-no uh food is is fried foods. Um I'm pretty sensitive to them and, and they really like although they're they're really good. They just don't make me feel good after I eat them. And I, I don't want to spend my vacation doing, you know, feeling like that. So I try to stay away from fried foods. Um, my slides are things that I enjoy, um, like New York style pizza, bagels, things that aren't the best for me, but I enjoy. And, and you know, I want to be able to experience those while I'm on vacation. So when we, when we establish these slides and no-nos, it, it takes away that stressful mental conflict we have with ourselves when food choices are presented to us. It kind of alleviates that guilty feeling after you've eaten something, you know, that, that post-consumption guilt. Um, and how much does that stink? It's like you, you know, you sit down and you finally, you know, eat something that you want to enjoy, but you're too busy being guilty or feeling guilty to enjoy it. So at that point, it doesn't even become worth it. So this kind of puts the control back in, in our hands. And I think, um, you know, when we talk about traveling and traveling, there, there are many different types of travel, and it looks different for all of us. This is something that can be implemented whether you're going away for a weekend or you're traveling through four countries over a month. It really doesn't matter. Airplane, car, train, you can still use it. For those of you that don't know, I'm headed on this uh, huge summer holiday. Uh, I leave tomorrow, actually. I'm kind of, eh. Uh, but um, I've done, you know, my thinking about my slides and my no-nos, and I've done that while I've been in the shower. I've done it you know, like laying in bed at night when I'm, when I should be sleeping, I've thought about it. My point is, is that it, it takes little to no time to just think about that. You can really do it at any point. Um, so, so give that a try. Um, enjoy yourself on vacation. Um, whether you're, you know, going away for a long weekend or you have a huge trip, or even if it's a staycation and you know, you're, you're having people come to visit you. Do not deprive yourself of food. That's not what this is about. It's about balance. But make sure you're mentally prepared so that you can feel in control of the decisions that you're making and you can enjoy them more. Um, so holy fit, you guys. Let's do this. I want you to think about your slides and no-nos. And um, yeah, let's, let's do this and enjoy our vacation. All right? Thanks, guys.